YouTube, what is good? It's your boy Answer Boss. Thank you for clicking on this video. I'm back with another Madden Ultimate Team video. And you know what? Today we're gonna have kind of shit on the Eastern promo once again. I was really, really, really disappointed to say the least in the last video, so I wanted to give it another shot. Now to start off this video, I wanted to first go ahead and ship out Jamal Charles. Now I've seen your comments, I've seen your tweets. I know it's time for a new running back, and today, Jamal Charles has exited the building he's currently going for 145 i don't even remember what i got him for like didn't i get him for like 600k so the fact that the price has dropped so much is ridiculous the running back that i will be bringing in is 99 overall marshawn lynch how could this 99 overall marshawn lynch go for this price the price is too low in my opinion if you don't have him on your team i don't know what you're doing you guys saw the stats right hello of course i'm gonna make this purchase you're looking at the new running back of our team i could not have been happier with this selection for now we're gonna have marshawn lynch so we'll see what he's capable of doing on my team the defense i know there's a lot of positions to work on like the right outside linebacker but guys i'm not trying to get too ahead of myself because you guys know there's gonna be golden tickets coming out soon well the golden ticket players and I'm not trying to upgrade my team right now. I'm going to wait for the golden ticket players. And depending on what comes out, we'll make moves then. But for now, I just wanted to upgrade my running back position. So today, we're going to be concentrating on the Easter promo. And I'm going to go ahead and open up the bundles that I just showed you guys. From the bundle, I just want this card right here. This is Sammy Watkins. Currently, the time that I was recording the video, there was only one up on the auction block. So... I know that's too much to ask for, but anything in the high 90s, I want one of those elite Easter players. Let's go ahead and get this thing started. The first Easter Sunday pack. We should be seeing a lot of stuff coming out of this. One other thing to note is, well, as you guys see right here, it popped up. I was just about to talk about this. Mystery eggs. I don't know what that is right there, but it's going to hatch pretty soon, and we'll see what we get out of it. Our first elite player, Lyle Collins. I've gotten so many of those, but I first want to go ahead and check out and see how much that egg goes. Now, I'm not sure from that pattern what it is. It goes for 78,000 coins, so something decent should be coming out of that. Look at this. TJ Yeldon. Another good pull right here, 96 overall, all rookie. This is my first time seeing it, so let's flip to the back of the card. 96 feet, 94 agility. Whoa, 97 acceleration and elusiveness, 99 carrying. This is actually a really, really good card. You know what? I think we're going to have to bring him to my team. So, David Johnson has exited the building as well. TJ Eldon, he will be running back number two for the time being so a great way to start off the pack here moving forward i'm getting a lot of gold players and another mystery egg 22 i'm not sure what this could be but hey that's a nice design like if i had a design on a shirt like that same design i would wear it out but as far as what player it is or what collectible whatever it is i'm not sure what that thing is get a michael bennett now each of these does come with a easter player either a gold or elite man i'm getting a lot of red flashes like i was saying each pack is guaranteed with a easter gold or elite player now i want to first go ahead and open up one of the toppers two guaranteed easter elite players and look what i get why these things hardly go for anything the goal is to get Sammy Watkins, and I'm not giving up yet. Hold on now. This is Mystery Egg 2. It says 10 times on it. Could it be maybe 10 badge packs? We do get an elite player out of this as well, so it's not a bad pack. A lot of gold players, and another Mystery Egg. This one says game on it. Could it be game contracts maybe? Back-to-back -back elites. We get a final edition. We also get a campus elite. So again, man, I'm not going to lie. The topper was kind of horrible. But these packs have had a lot of value coming out of them. Look at this. Trent Richardson. I honestly did not think 
we will be getting a Trent Richardson card this year, but you guys see a Campus Elite 92 overall. Here's the back of the card. Man, we're like five minutes into the video and it's been just straight up pack opening. Like that tells you out of the two bundles that I got, we've been getting really, really good cards out of them. I don't want to jinx myself because we still have the bundle topper. But to end things off, we get straight golds. Here we go. Our final bundle topper. It comes with two guaranteed Easter players. Who will it be? Another Sheard. Finally, for a change, we do get Mike Pouncey. But guys, let me tell you this. These things don't go for a lot. Now, moments later, I got this mystery egg once again. It's mystery egg number 12. It looked really, really cool. I'm not going to lie. When I checked the price, it suddenly became even cooler 208,000 coins something must be up with this i'm definitely gonna not get any sleep to see what's gonna hatch out of that huh should i, should I do that oh, i'm kidding i'm not gonna do that so i did do this easter player set for you guys i did it three times so we are guaranteed three easter players we get a melvin ingram okay well at least it is something new but I jinxed myself. This is a Ryan Fitzpatrick case all over again. Another wow. To be honest, it's time. It's time to play a game. So let's go ahead and jump into a match. I'm Larry Ridley as we get set to bring you coverage from Madden Ultimate. Here we go. The debut of Marshawn Lynch on my team yesterday. I actually did a real life draft champions, and that's when you guys really. Saw Marshawn Lynch, and I saw the comment section. You guys not only love the idea, but you guys also like Marshawn Lynch's performance. I was like, you know what? I have to bring him in to my actual Ultimate Team Series. And so far, we're kind of not off to a good start. It's already 3-0, but you guys see TJ Yeldon gets the first look. On 3rd and 13, Michael Vick right here decides to keep this one on the ground. There goes another first. 3rd and 6. Vic has been getting it done by himself in this quarter with two minutes remaining. He is leading a beautiful, uh, actually a, a well put together drive. Because right now we're doing it all. We're passing it and we are successfully moving the ball on the ground. Go with a play action here. A beautiful throw to Brandon Cooks. Now we are at the five yard line. 41 seconds remaining and Zach Thomas just ruins the entire drive that was kind of my fault though a horrible pass but we do make it up on defense as we get a sack here with 12 seconds remaining i call the timeout because i want to get the ball back here we are chucking the ball deep to megatron and that's what he is going to do that's what he's here to do let's go That was exactly what we needed to go into the locker rooms and you can tell my opponent is kind of phased by our performance at the end of the first half and here he is I don't know what he's up to he's doing a lot of dance moves but it worked here once again he drops back with Steve Young Steve Young this defender chasing him down almost gets brought down as he throws up a prayer it's Laurent Landry coming down with the pick I don't know how he was able to hang on to that Third and 11, Michael Vick, we took way too much time in the pocket. That is completely my fault. Look at where my opponent is already at the 33-yard line. A lot of time, gets rid of it, and wow! What a catch by Jerry Rice. Just like that, my opponent has the lead once again. We give it to the beast mode. Thirty-nine, Vic. Vic breaks a tackle, but it looks like we're short on fourth and one. I know this is very gutsy, but I decided to go for it, and that was a horrible throw. So once again, my opponent takes over. We need to stop that. That's exactly what we don't do. We gave up a first down to my opponent, and it couldn't have come at a worse time. 
Luckily, we still have our three timeouts. We have to make sure that he punts the ball. I mean, I'll even take a field goal by my opponent. But if he keeps on getting first downs and choose the clock away, we're done. Third and seven. It's an incomplete pass. Two minutes remaining, and you're one half down. Now with three timeouts, a minute 47 to work with. I like our chances. Handoff on the counter to Marshawn Lynch. Loses the ball. No. Let's strip the ball. Let's strip the ball away. We stripped the ball away. Who was that? What a turn of events. First, we lose the ball. Our offensive... Wait a minute. Hold up. There's a booth review. It's overturned. Wait. Wow. When it got overturned, I thought my opponent was going to get the ball back. But it is actually our ball. So that means that Marshawn Lynch was actually down on the play. Look at Brandon Cooks. Such a big deal in the NFL. That's why they're hurrying up. Don't use that timeout. Keep those timeout decisions for the coach here. You're down. It's late in the game. Get in that hurry up offense. For sure. Second down and four. Catch made. And he's tackled down after the clock. Fixed completion percentage 60% on the day. Third and six. 19 seconds remaining. Michael Vick going to. Jared Cole comes down at the one yard line and thank God we still had timeouts. On the toss play, Marshawn Lynch seals the deal. It's actually not over yet with 10 seconds remaining. He still has two timeouts as well. A deep bomb, it's an incomplete pass. His receiver did have a chance at that play, but here he is once again rolling out this one is going out of bounds. You guys know what that means. We are going to be walking away with the victory. I like Marshawn Lynch's debut, man. TJ Yeldon, he was also a great pull. So it's going to be interesting to see what happens with my team going forward. Who will we bring in? We'll see what happens as more and more content come out. It's your boy, Onto the Boss. I am signing out. I hope you guys enjoy this.